Marcy. Marcy, uh, were you taking tips from DeBrusque on the penalty yeah. shot there? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know, it, it's it's nice when those ones work out. Um, you know, the only thing that I was really thinking about was don't miss it. You know, so that worked out good. The hard part, uh, I get by that pretty quick and luckily that one went in. Does, does opening night ever get old for you? No, I, I think, you know. Especially after what you've been through. Yeah, too. no, the summer. Uh, it kind of drags on, and then training camp really drags on, especially this year. Um, I think we're all, we always get excited to, to get back and see the team that we have and uh, be in front of a crowd again, and, you know, a lot more normal this year than the last couple. So um, it was really exciting coming in this year, and a little nerve wracking actually, but uh, butterflies, I guess, but that was fun. Uh, how amped up was the room heading into this one? Just how you guys had had to wait so long. I'm yeah, it did it, 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 it? You know, it almost felt like you had to go through summer twice. Um, you know, the training part and then training camp again. It just, like I said, it dragged on. Um, but I, I think also just with the group that we have, and, and um, you know, we bonded so quick already, and, and really come together quickly. And I think we're all really excited to see what we're going to do this year, um, how it's going to play out. And I think tonight was a great. Great example, um, especially early with, with how good of a team we're going to be. I mean, we haven't had a whole lot of time to, to be together and, and only a couple of games. And, um, you know, we were good tonight. Uh, also, we weren't great all the way through, but um, considering it's our first regular season game, I think uh, we have to be happy. Right. Can you go through the sequence leading up to the penalty shot? Because first you have to intercept the play, but then make sure the play stays on side. How, how did you process it? Yeah, you know what, I kind of actually let up for a second after I picked it up because um, I didn't see, I think it was past the offside right away and then saw him kind of coming and I kind of waited like kind of in a split second to see if it was going to be off and then uh, one of the other whistlers kind of kept going and, and uh, tried to get inside the suitor, um, you know, and luckily they, they called that one. Anything else? Uh -oh. Impressed have you been this whole training camp and then this first game with Swayman? You know, had a little bit of success last year at the end, and just to see the way he's approached it coming back this year. Yeah, I'm more impressed with your mask today. That's it. <laughs> Thanks, yeah. <Paul. laughs> um, yeah, Sway, he, he's just, you know, I love that kid. He, he's such a good uh, person uh, in the room and off the ice, and, um, you know, he fits in great. He's so genuine, uh, and he. He's been very calm from the first day he's been been here. He, just, he has the confidence about him in the net that uh, you know he's going to play well and, and he's continuing to impress. And um, you know I'm very excited to see how his season's going to go. But uh, great showing tonight. Uh, he's been great all camp. Yeah. I'll do teenage mutant ninja Joe. Next time, perfect. <laughs> Didn't uh, produce the results, but thoughts on the power play and, and Charlie McAvoy being on there? Yeah, we're okay. Yeah, it was okay. You know we had we had a couple chances. Um, it, yeah, it's tough on that ice out there. These these bucks are kind of exploding everywhere. But um, you know, we we haven't played together a ton. Uh, I think the more we 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 all connect and and uh, get on the same page, the better we're gonna get. Brad, what do you think about the way that Jake Dubrovsky has approached this season and played well in training camp, mm -hmm. and now it carries over into the first game? Yeah, I've been really happy with uh, the way he's played. Um, you know, Jake's a guy that uh, feeds off. Uh, confidence and, and he has it right now but even the way that he's kind of carrying himself off the ice has much ener much better uh, energy about him and, and uh, a lot more excitement this year um, and he's a guy that we need to rely on to, to, if we're going to go far um, and he can be such a difference maker with the speed and his uh, ability to put pucks in around the net like you see that tonight so uh, I thought you know I was more impressed uh, with the details in this game tonight uh, where he hounded pucks on that first goal, or on his goal, um, and, and turned it over, created a loose puck for Foligno and Holla to, to kind of do the thing, and then he went to the net and got rewarded. So, you know, his details, when he takes care of them, he's a hell of a player. Sean? Brad, you have uh, some new players in the lineup, of course, tonight, and mostly veterans, but um, before the game, did you talk to them about what to expect from playing a, a regular season game on the home, uh, with the home team here at the Garden? No, um, you know, I, I, again, all of our, all of our guys are, are very dialed in and been around for a while. And, and uh, you know, I 
think that they're comfortable now in the group. They've been here before. They know it's a, it's a hard building to play in. I think they're more just excited to, to be on this side of it, uh, to be cheered for. Um, but, uh, you know, they're, they're professionals. They're going to prepare the same way, regardless of the building that they're in. But uh, um, I think they're yeah, an idea of what to expect. All right. Thank you, Marshy. Thanks, guys.